Well, it's a brisk, cold, sunny day, and I just wanted to spend a few minutes to you talking about Jesus and two disciples on the road to Emmaus in your morning cup of inspiration. The reason I want to talk to you about this story found in Luke chapter 24, and I encourage you to go there and read it, is because I think a lot of us are feeling the way these two disciples were feeling on that day. Now, they weren't two of the 12 disciples, but they were two of the 120, the greater group that was following the Lord. And as they were talking to each other, they were discussing the events of the past week and how Jesus had been turned over to the chief priests and the government officials and how he had been crucified and buried. And as they were walking, a third gentleman started walking along with them. And he said, what are you guys talking about? And they said, have you not been around Jerusalem lately? You haven't heard all the talk? And they proceeded to tell him about this Jesus and what had happened to him and how they were certain that he was the Messiah, but now he was dead, and it was the third day. And they didn't realize that they were actually talking to Jesus himself, because this was the day he arose from the dead. And he said to them, why are you guys so downcast? You know, don't you know this had to happen? This was all predicted by the prophets. And he started to encourage and encourage them. And when they arrived at their home, they asked Jesus if he wanted to stay with them and have dinner and, and maybe spend the night before he continued on his journey. And he did. And when he took the food before they ate, he blessed it. And then he gave it to them and their eyes were opened and they realized it was Jesus. And then he vanished and they ran to tell the other disciples that he was indeed arisen. And then Jesus appeared there too. And it's just an uplifting story. But how many times have maybe we've been in a really difficult place on our journey and on our road and we've been kind of complaining and we've been downcast we don't realize that Jesus is right there walking with us. And he's right there with us now. As you walk through life, as I walk through life, every day he is with us. And we need to have our eyes open to realize that it's him, the Son of God, the creator of the universe, our everything walks with us. And he gives us hope and he gives us strength and he gives us courage. Let's pray. Lord, I thank you for the road to Emmaus and the lessons that we learn when we allow you to walk with us and we realize you're there helping us along in our journey. We thank you so much for being there, for walking with each and every person that's listening to this today. May they be blessed. May they be encouraged by your presence. In thy name I pray. Amen. I hope that encourages you. Have a great day, and I'll see you soon for another morning cup of inspiration. And remember to check out our podcasts. They're posted right here on our Facebook page, or you can get them at ffaith.org or wherever you hear podcasts. I hope you have a good day. God bless.